Dramatic footage captured by the Royal National Lifeboat Institution shows the rescue operation underway after a helicopter crashed into the North Sea yesterday evening. Four people were killed in the incident. 46-year-old Duncan Munro from Bishop Auckland, 45-year-old Sarah Darnley from Elgin, 59-year-old Gary McCrossan from Inverness and 57-year-old George Allison from Winchester. The Super Puma L2 aircraft went down at 6.20pm around two miles west of Sumba Airport on Shetland. The aircraft was carrying 16 workers and two crew members at the time of the incident when it's believed to have experienced a catastrophic loss of power. 14 people were taken to safety during the immediate rescue response, including two crew members. Our latest update from Aberdeen is that there have been some survivors from the incident, um, but there is still one person outstanding. As far as the person from our community is concerned, we haven't yet had it confirmed whether he has been identified as yet. Police Scotland are still making inquiries. Police Scotland are still dealing with it as a major incident. The helicopter's operator, CHC, has said it was flying for oil company Total and that the aircraft lost communication as it approached the airport on the southern tip of Shetland's main island. Police Scotland said they will now be carrying out an investigation to establish the full circumstances.